Welcome back, fight fans, to another video here on Raw Life. In this video, we're going to take a look at when Teofimo Lopez was 15 and sparred Gervonta Davis, who was 18 at the time. Neither fighter was going 100% in this sparring, but when Gervonta Davis wanted to throw, he landed. Teofimo's dad told him to be careful of the left hand from Gervonta Davis. Teofimo was fast at the time, but his man's strength careful, was man. yet to come in. As you can see, Tank was letting Lopez throw his punches so he could calculate and read his style. Gervonta starts walking him down and controlling Lopez with his feints. You can hear Gervonta's friend in the background comment as Gervonta Davis starts moving forward. Teofimo's dad tells Lopez that he's too fast for Tank as Gervonta Davis makes a miss with a three punch combination. You can see Davis controlling Lopez without throwing any punches, but just using feints. But when Tank throws, he lands his punches. You can clearly see the experience and age difference in this sparring session. You can tell that Gervonta is not trying to hurt Lopez, but trying to get a learning experience from this sparring session. Teofimo's dad tells Lopez to let's go, because he sees Gervonta Davis walking him down. As you can see, Tank could throw punches at whatever time he wants, but he's not trying to hurt Lopez. Shoot that right hand, man. Tank takes a couple steps back to bait Lopez into a left hand. Don't get off your game plan, bro. Just keep on boxing. Teofimo's dad even sees that Gervonta Davis is getting Lopez out of his game plan. Round two. Teofimo comes out more serious and throwing more punches. Lopez lands it right to the body and then a right up top. Then a one-two, and then follows it up with some body shots. You could tell Gervonta didn't like those shots, so he starts walking down Lopez. Teofimo's dad tells him that he can land those punches all day, but Gervonta Davis starts putting pressure. Tank baits him with his movement, then lands a left hand, which ends up getting hurt. If you look closely, Gervonta trips over his trainer's foot and falls, which looks like a knockdown. Davis immediately gets up and starts fighting with aggression. Let's do it, bro. You got a gangbang now, bro. Come on. He's going to come after you. Come on. Teofimo's dad knew Gervonta didn't like going down, so he knew Davis was coming for some blood. Davis landed two good left hands and stopped to ask Lopez if he was good because he thought he heard him. Davis continued his attack while landing a lot of power punches. Get out! Get out of there! You got it, Bobby. Come on. 
Let's box. Let's box. Let's box. Let's box. Pick up your hands. No es nada. No es nada. Vamos. Teofimo's dad said those punches weren't nothing, but Gervonta ended up dropping Teofimo's mouthpiece out his mouth. Come on, go. Calmate, okay? Él se está frustrando. Tú muévete por alrededor. Teofimo's dad told him to calm down and that Gervonta Davis was frustrating him and to move around. Teofimo lands some good punches, but he doesn't have the power that he has now. Watch it, he's looking for that one punch. Be careful. Teofimo's dad knew Gervonta was baiting Lopez the entire sparring session. Teofimo's dad told Lopez to throw something and not to be scared of those feints. You can see Gervonta gain confidence because Lopez was falling for all those feints. Teofimo's dad tells Lopez, what do you do to lefties? And then Gervonta lands a perfect right hook. You can tell Lopez learned a lot from this sparring session and has grown a lot. But Gervonta Davis was landing at will and has always been a power puncher. Teofimo hits him in the back of the head and gets Gervonta Davis mad. Teofimo's dad tries justifying the shots behind the head. Yeah, leave him, coach. We just fucking around. Leave him. I ain't saying shit. But Davis didn't forget and starts applying the pressure. Watch that right. Watch that, Watch that lap, baby. Watch that lap. Teofimo's dad knew Gervonta was going for a knockout. Comment down below and tell me who do you think would win this fight in 2021. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button with the notifications on to get the videos as soon as they come out.